Ferrari 335S Spider Scaglietti, Bugatti Varian Grand Sport, Bugatti Chiron, McLaren, Rolls Royce, Lamborghini, and many more supercars are owned by famous football players. Well, if you could, I would like it if you guys typed in the comment section who is your favorite football player, whether it's Ronaldo or Messi or any other one, maybe. And if you really are a fan of any football player, so you might know about their expensive car collection. I mean, come on, rich people love cool cars, right? But it's okay, so even if you don't know, you don't gotta be worried. Just watch this video and we'll show you all the cars in their cool collection. Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna bring you a live report of famous people and the most expensive cars which are owned by said famous people. So let's get into the video without wasting any more time. We all know that football players are paid very, very well for their services, mainly due to their high popularity and also their talent and the shortness of their football career. With these large bank balances that they got, many football players love to spend lavishly on expensive items like real estate, you know. They like to live in luxurious hotels or spend holidays there and most notably love to buy expensive cars. Of course, as with any sport, some of those players got to be the best ones on the team and are paid very well, even better than their teammates. And trust me, those people generally love to have expensive car collections. As well as that, they're very rare and are made in limited numbers. Let's start with Cristiano Ronaldo's car collection. Ever since becoming the best football player in the world, Cristiano Ronaldo has had a great love towards luxurious and expensive cars. Cristiano Ronaldo has a net worth of more than $478 million, so why wouldn't he purchase luxury cars? When he's not playing, he splurges lavishly on all types of cars. So let's take a look. Ronaldo Ronaldo has 15 plus cars in his collection, including the Bugatti Varian Grand Sport, the Bugatti Chiron, the Rolls-Royce Phantom, the McLaren Senna, the Ferrari F12, the Ferrari 599 GTO, the Lamborghini Aventador, the BMW M6, the Bentley Continental GT, Range Rover SVR, the Audi RS7, the Audi R8, Mercedes C63 AMG, Mercedes GLE AMG, Porsche Cayenne, Aston Martin DB9, Maserati Gran Cabrillo, Porsche 911 Turbo S, McLaren MP412C, and Rolls-Royce Cullinan. Oh my god, guys. That is so many cars. But the most expensive car in his collection is the Bugatti La Voiture Noire, which cost him around 8.5 million euros. Did you know that there are only 10 of these Bugattis around, and one of which is owned by Ronaldo? The car is powered by a 1,500 PS 8-liter 16-cylinder engine, which can reach speeds of up to 380 kilometers per hour, with a sprint of 0 to 60 per hour in just two 2.4 seconds. And not just this, but the car is also badged with CR7 in front of each rear wheel. So, let's take a look at David Beckham's car collection. Y'all probably already know David Beckham, and he probably doesn't need an introduction, so I'm just gonna give you a small one. David Beckham is one of the best former football players ever, and he's also amongst one of the highest earning sportsmen in the world, and indeed of all time. Judging by the makes and models of his cars, you can actually get a sense of what kind of cars he likes. And yeah, it might not need to be mentioned that he is a pretty big car fan. Do you know that he also has a total of 15 plus cars in his whole collection? Let's take a look at some of them. His car collection includes a Jeep Wrangler, a Cadillac Escalade, BMW M6, a Jaguar XJ, a Hummer H2, Range Rover Sport, Chevrolet Camaro, a Bentley Continental GT, a McLaren, an MP412C, Lamborghini Gallardo, Ferrari F360 Spider, Rolls-Royce Ghost, Rolls-Royce Phantom, a coup, Bentley Mulsanne, Porsche 911, Bentley Bentaga, Bentley Continental GT Supersport, and a Ferrari Scaglietti. The most expensive car in his garage is the Rolls-Royce Phantom Drophead Coup. This car cost him nearly 450,000 US dollar runes. The Phantom Rolls Royce is powered by a 6.75 liter V12 engine, making 453 brake horsepower and 720 newton meters. Beckham's Rolls Royce Phantom Drophead Coup is a black shade with custom aftermarket 24 inch black rims that look pretty killer. The Phantom Drophead Coup is based on the Phantom model and takes its design cues from the 100EX concept car that, that Rolls Royce showcased back in 2004. Moving on to the next one, the car collection of Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. How could we forget Aubameyang if we're talking about the car collections of famous football players? Commonly known as Aubameyang by people all over the world, Pierre Emerick Aubameyang is a professional football player and he plays for the Premier League club Arsenal. He was born in France and he captains Angabon national team. He also expressed his love towards cars by saying that the clothes, the car, and all that are a bonus. I enjoy living this way. I like who I am, and it doesn't matter if other people can't accept that. It just goes over my head. As they say, you only live once. Well, it's true. That we only live once, and everybody wants to enjoy that to the fullest. I mean, haven't you seen Obama Young's car collection? Oh, right, I'm, I'm showing you that. 
Let's take a look. The guy has racked up over $80 million, and I bet that guy likes to spend all that on cars. And not just one or two. Obama Young has a collection of 12 cars, including Ferraris, gold-plated Lamborghinis, Porsches, Range Rovers. But nothing can be compared to his $2 million massive Ferrari LaFerrari. Only 449 LaFerraris were ever made in 2018, and all were instantly sold before they came to market. His LaFerrari has a 6.3-liter V12 engine capable of 950 braking horsepower as well as a top speed of at least 227 miles per hour. It's also capable of hitting a top speed of 0 to 60 in just 2.9 seconds. So, do you know what? That Obama Young wants his car to be customized, and he wants his car the way he likes. And that job is done by North London-based company car customizer Yanni Sherlambis. His gold-plated Lamborghini, a silver-plated 270,000 euro Lamborghini, and a custom-wrapped car too. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, how could I forget Lionel Messi? The highest paid football player in Europe, FC Barcelona's best football player, Lionel Messi, owns several highly expensive and luxurious cars, just like that of Ronaldo. But he has many more expensive cars than Ronaldo, not that it's a contest, but he has a net worth of over 400 million US dollars, with which he's bought a lot of expensive cars. Let's take a look. His car collection includes the most expensive Ferrari 335S Spider Scaglietti, and many other cars, like the Pagani Zonda Tricolor the Mercedes SLS AMG, the Maserati Gran Turismo, the MC Stradale, the Ferrari F430 Spider, the Audi RS6, the Audi A7, the Audi Q7, the Audi R8 Spider, the Range Rover Vogue, the Range Rover Sport, Cadillac Escalade, and Lexus RX 450 horsepower. His most expensive car that he had ever bought was the Ferrari 335 S Spider Scaglietti, which cost him around 37 million US dollars. He bought this car in an auction. This is the most expensive car ever sold at an auction. See, the 1957 Ferrari 335 S Spider Scaglietti is one of the rarest Ferraris in existence. As this is the rarest car ever, the bid was started at an average price of $20 million. Later then, the price extended by different persons, and it was later bought by Messi. This car was driven by many great racers. The car was first driven by Peter Collins and Maurice Toitignon in the year 1957, severing 12 hours, then by Wolfgang von Tripp in the Mille Miglia in May of that year, where it finished in second place. Later then, by Mike Hawthorne, who is the World F1 Champ of the Year 1958. And then he drove the car in the 24 Heure du Mans, setting the first lap record in the history of the event, over 200 kilometers per hour, which is 124 miles per hour. And so, my dudes, we've raced towards the end of this video. So, I hope you all watched the whole video. And if you did and you liked it, don't forget to press the button that says you did. Oh, yeah, wait, where y'all going without hitting that little red subscribe button? You know, gives us more inspiration to make these amazing videos and scour the internet for content to bring to your table. I'm so awesome. Anyways, subscribe and maybe watch our other videos as well. And yeah, see you guys in the next one.